guys welcome back to star soaps channel how are you today good i hope i am back for a second part video today of a leather test i missed out sorry joan on the gentle hands natural soap treats and tat episode that was a few episodes back so if you missed that episode i'll leave a link below and you can go check it out and today we're going to lather up those soaps and see how they bubble so let's go and feel the soapy love Squee! Alrighty, so here we are at my laundry sink the first one that we're going to lather up is the one that i thought smelled a little bit like a um maybe a cologne or um yeah like a men a man's fragrance or very fresh it's very fresh smelling i like it so lather this up whoa instant bubbles wow look at those they're huge can you see those Come a bit closer Yummy, and it's very creamy. It's a very lotiony leather, and huge bubbles, big bubbles. Very, very nice. Hmm, might even be like a fresh rain scent or something like that. Okay, so next up, I'm going to do the Nug Chumpa. And again, this is my guess. I'm guessing it's Nug Chumper because it didn't have a name on it either. These two just came unlabeled. But I love, um, I think I already talked about this in the last video, but I love the top on this. It kind of reminds me of the shape of a rainbow. And I'm very intrigued as to how she has achieved that. It's beautiful, like sort of waves. So let's lather this one up. Very strong Nug Chumper scent. Please tell me, Joan, in the comments below, if you're there, because <laughs> she took a break from the internet for a while, that um, I'm right, or if I'm wrong, about this, if this is actually Nug Chumper. Again, very similar. I'm guessing same recipe. It um, lathers big bubbles to um, begin with, like instantly, these really big bubbles lather up, and then it goes to a very lotiony, creamy, just leaves you feeling just gorgeous, and oh, I love that scent. So earthy, very, very, very happy. Love it. Love, love, love. <laughs> With a name like Crystal Star, how could I not? So now we're on to the fruity soaps that she sent me, which I'm stoked. I love fruity soaps. The first one will be the Love Spell type that has this really gorgeous dandelion zebra layered sort of in like on the side here. Rainbow of blue and yellow and pink. And is scented in the lovely fruity citrusy punchy kind of um smell of love spell which i love yep the same again same recipe i reckon huge big bubbles to begin with can you see those bubbles like immediately you get these and then as you work it it becomes more of like a lotion lather i would actually probably put a warning that people should watch out that their tubs get slippery my mum had told me about how slippery my tub ah sorry my soap made her tub so i've been thinking about putting a little warning on mine that it's just makes because it's so much more um conditioning with soap this handmade soap than any kind of commercial soap so it can just leave that little bit of a slippery feel on the bottom of the tub so lucky last and the one that i'm going to be putting into my shower as soon as i'm finished with this video is the beautiful peach butter bar this was made with triple butters i believe it was coco shea and mango and it has a beautiful shimmery top and it's scented in this yummy peach just so delicious peach um very it's it's not too much like a candy peach it's a bit like a candy peach and a bit sort of i'd say 50 50 oh but i really like it so that one's going in my shower as soon as we're finished here this one may, may produce a different lather seeing as it's made with the butters so let's check it out <laughs> once again look at those big bubbles actually oh this might be a better one in the bath soak in a bath and have this I know that sounds silly, like it would make, make that much of a difference if you use in the shower or the bath, but... Oh, I love it. Oh, it's very nice. It's, uh, it's a bit slower to create those bubbles, but you still get that wonderful lotion-y leather, 
and I mean, you could shave with all of these soaps. They would all make great shaving soaps. Mm-hmm. Oh, and they're all really solid, so that means they're all going to last really well. The beautiful peach, peach butter bar. I love that. Peach butter bar. Okay. So, now I'll just bring you over so you can see the soaps glistening away after we've leather tested them. Aren't they gorgeous? You have done an amazing job, Joan. You keep up the good work, you soap master, you. They are delicious. They are solid. They bubble amazing. They smell amazing. Tick, 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 tick. <laughs> well, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and watching how Joan soaps lathered. And I'm sorry I missed it out in the first part. But hey, here we are now with the second part, so bonus! And if you enjoyed this video, you thought it was a bit of a laugh and you want to see more like this, feel free to hit that subscribe button below, become a member of the Star Soaps family, and feel the soapy love. <laughs> Bye! Another soap that makes your body feel like star soap if you need love in the driest area. Remember.